Hey everyone, let's talk about the diagnosis and staging of multiple myeloma. If you come across the All for Cure website, you're probably a multiple myeloma patient or you know someone that has multiple myeloma. You may be wondering what goes into the diagnosis of this disease. In this video, we'll talk about the specific criteria needed to diagnose and stage multiple myeloma. First, your oncologist will look at the CRAB criteria, which includes hypercalcemia, renal insufficiency, anemia, and bone lesions. They'll also look at a bone marrow biopsy result, free light chain levels, and monoclonal protein levels. After running all these tests, your oncologist can diagnose you with multiple myeloma if you fall under one of these two categories. After diagnosis, your multiple myeloma will be staged. On All for Cure, we record the ISS staging on your dashboard. This staging is dependent on the beta-2 microglobulin and albumin levels. There is another staging system called the Revised International Staging System. They use the beta-2 microglobulin and albumin levels, as well as LDH levels and cytogenetic results. All for Cure does not record the RISS staging on the dashboard. Beta-2 microglobulin is found on the surface of many cells. It is generally used as a tumor marker. In non-myeloma patients, these levels are very low. Albumin is a protein found in the blood. It helps keep the fluid within the bloodstream. Low levels of albumin can indicate a problem with the liver or the kidneys. As the stages of multiple myeloma increase, the beta-2 microglobulin level increases as well. However, the albumin level decreases. If you don't meet the criteria for multiple myeloma, you may be diagnosed with a non-malignant condition. You could either be diagnosed with monoclonal gammopathy of undetermined significance, or MGUS, or smoldering multiple myeloma. The criteria to be diagnosed with MGUS and smoldering myeloma are lower than the criteria to be diagnosed with multiple myeloma. High-risk smoldering myeloma has its own criteria. Some oncologists and patients discuss whether starting treatment is the right choice for them. If you look on the All for Cure dashboard, you'll see that we record the specific diagnosis and staging of your multiple myeloma. Thanks for watching this video. To see our other videos, go to allforcure.com.